First, what we're going to do is I'm just going to give you a little demonstration of what a mask is. <clears throat> Essentially, we're going to use a shape to mask out certain aspects of a, a photograph or, or an object in a layer, etc. So I've got myself a photograph here. I uh, just put it on its own layer. Um, and if you want to create a mask, you just create a new layer. I'm going to name that mask. It can be named whatever you want, but it's probably best to name it something that makes sense. And I'm just going to draw a shape. I'm going to draw a circle here. So the mask is going to hide part of this photograph. In Flash, it works with the opposite of other programs. Uh, in Photoshop, whatever's black hides and whatever white shows. In Flash, whatever um, this object is touching, so anywhere in this black area, doesn't matter what the color is, if it's blue, anywhere in this blue area now that this object is touching or is over will be shown. Anything that it's not over will be hidden. So to make this a mask layer, I'm just going to double click that icon in the timeline and choose mask. Say OK. Now, <clears throat> currently it's not masking anything. Uh, it's just sitting there. Uh, if you want this to, to hide an aspect of any layer, it can be an object, a photograph, or whatever, just grab that layer that you want affected by that mask and just click diagonally. Notice that little line is, is moving catty corner underneath that mask layer and the icons changed into this kind of checkerboard transparent icon. All right, You can't see the mask unless both layers are locked so that's important. But Once they're locked you can see that anything that that shape is over will be shown. Okay now this can be turned into a symbol uh, and animate it, so let's go ahead and do that, or let's at least show you how to do that. So I've made that into a symbol. I'm going to move it over here to the left. I'm going to get some frames, F5, add a tween. All right, so I've got a little animation here. Let's test it and see what happens. So you can see anywhere that that ball is touching, even if it's animated, that's what's going to be revealed. So that's how a mask works. So let's get to the, the to the tutorial. 